it is one thing to read about something. It's also another thing altogether to taste of it and partake of it. And that's exactly the case with this our fermented papaya. Look at it. It has finished. This is the last dose of it. Today is the third day after fermentation of the uh, unripe papaya. And remember that once you ferment a food, it's already preserved by the by that process of, uh, of fermentation. So you do not actually need refrigeration. If you do have opportunity to refrigerate it, you can do so, but it's no longer a must that you must have to refrigerate it. And so in this very video, I want to share three things that I have learned from this very drink recently. And I wish I knew it earlier than now. Number one, it supports your heart health. Now, those of you who are complaining of one heart problem or one heart-related issue or the other, you may benefit from this drink. Remember, it's a source of the antioxidant vitamin E. And vitamin E is one of the rare antioxidants that your heart requires to function very well, especially as you age. And there are very few foods that are good sources of this antioxidant vitamin E. And so consuming this drink has opened up, also opened my eyes that it's good for those that need to strengthen their heart health. Merely taking it. Number two is that it boosts your energy naturally. Being a source of uh, antioxidant A, C, and E, I was of the view that it may not really boost energy since it doesn't have protein and the rest of it, and it's not really sweet apart from the sour taste. But surprisingly, you can take your water therapy and then take this drink and go about whatever you want to do, particularly those of you who are trying to lower your bad cholesterol. You can benefit from this drink by just taking it in the morning to prepare your intestine for the work of digestion for the day. But remember, it shouldn't be a daily drink. You take it and you give yourself some break. And the last one is something that, in fact, is surprising to me. And that is the fact that this particular drink, apart from boosting your energy, uh, and then supporting your heart health. It's also great for for cold. Yes, I was. It surprised me because I was having something like a runny nose, which is a sure sign of suppressed immunity. Remember, in that video, I said I decided to make this drink to boost my immunity, and I mean, gladly speaking, it did that job and quite well. It was so instant. I mean, as soon as I took this drink, yesterday being the third, uh, the second day of it, today is the third day, that running nose ceased immediately. And that's the sure evidence that it's not just about, being, I mean, doing a test or research, but you can actually take these things and find out things yourself. Don't forget, moderation remains our rule. Go ahead and make your own and tell us what you, you also find out. And don't forget to click the follow button and to subscribe also for more.